there's a great talk that was given in conference uh, a number of years ago by Elder Simmons, and he spent this talk talking about this but if not aspect of this story. Shadrach, Meshach and Abednego knew that they could trust God, even if things didn't turn out the way they hoped. They knew that faith is more than mental assent, more than an acknowledgement that God lives. Faith is total trust in him. We must have the same faith as Shadrach, Meshach and Abednego. Our God will see that we receive justice and fairness, but if not, he will make sure that we are loved and recognized, but if not, we will receive a perfect companion and righteous and obedient children. But if not, we will have faith in the Lord Jesus Christ, knowing that if we will do all we can, we will. And in his time and in his way, be delivered and receive all that he has. I want to talk a little bit about um, my experience, my personal experience with that, right? When I was 17, I received my patriarchal blessing, right? And part of that patriarchal blessing promised me that the day would surely come when a righteous priesthood holder would desire to take me to the temple. And the promise was that we would have children who would be brought up in righteousness, etc., etc. Um, when I first received that as a 17-year-old, I thought, yeah, duh, of course, that's what's going to happen, right? Um, that I'm going to get married, that I'm going to have children and those kinds of things. But as my life has panned out and that hasn't happened, I, ha I have to admit there are times where I'm going, hang on a minute, God, you promised me this. What, what, what's wrong? Am I a sinner? Am I not drop dead gorgeous enough? Am I not? And I had all of that negative self-talk that we sometimes get in. And, and sometimes it was hard to come to church. Um, it was hard to do that. And, and I went through a difficult period of time as I was thinking, is there a place for me in, this, in, this, in the church and the kingdom of God? These thoughts came into my mind. Do you know that I live? And my answer to that was absolutely. How do you know that? How do you know? Do I love you? Yeah, yeah. How do you know that? Because I felt, right, your, your inspiration, your direction, your guidance in all of those things. So if that is true, even if these things aren't going to come right here and right now, I had to make this decision. I choose the kingdom of God. And even though those blessings aren't immediately there for mine, even if I don't see them in this life, I made the choice. I choose to stand with the brethren and the kingdom 